ever wanted to start a new project or learn a new skill, maybe photography or, or web design, painting, going back to school, maybe you just wanted to start a new business. And almost out of nowhere, someone tried to shoot you down, maybe a boss, a manager, friend, or even a spouse. Start, you know, they start chirping in your ear and, and saying, ah, you know what, I don't, I don't know if we should really do that. And you know, they've got all these good intentions, but nonetheless, they're, they're, what's happening is, number one, it's causing you stress. You're saying, why is this person doing this? Why are they trying to shoot my dream down? But number two, and probably more important, is they're planting seeds of doubt. A while back, I was able to interview a lady from Tokyo, Japan. Her name was Kasako Uramatsu. She's only one of four flight instructors in all of Japan. And in a culture where the woman is often viewed as housekeeper, mother, and maid, Kasako was cut from a different kimono. In other words, she adored independence. And one day, she had a friend invite her, uh, this is when she was in college, she had a friend invite her to the quad. There was going to be a meeting, and the meeting was simply about flying. Hey, you interested in flying? Let us talk to you about it. And Kasika was thinking, what, flying? What? I don't want a pilot? What, what's that all about? But she went anyway, and she got hooked. And the more she, she invested in this, this, this flying idea of becoming a pilot, the more passionate she became with it. And pretty soon, she started to fall in love with the idea of flying. And she had the support of her father. He was 100% behind her. However, there was another person in her life that didn't think flying was such a hot idea. At the time, Kasako was dating a Japanese doctor. And one day, he floored Kasako with an ultimatum. He said, if you become a pilot, we cannot marry. Kasako reeled. She said, what are you talking about, man? I, do you know what you're doing to me? You're giving me some ultimatum of, of the relationship versus the total freedom I'm feeling with this flying business? And that is where we're coming full circle to. Kasako had the, she had the desire, she had the determination, she had assessed different situations, she knew what she would accept and what she wouldn't accept, and now she had to make a tough decision between rings or wings. The doctor got dumped. You know, you and I are going to face situations like Kasako had to face sooner or later. There's going to be people, like I say, chirping in our ear and they're going to plant doubt. So the next time someone comes to you and plants seeds of doubt in your mind, you now know what to tell them. Sayonara.